Good morning. Today is Monday, the 18th of July. Um, on the 19th, it will be, let's see, two months since I was diagnosed with cancer. Um, so far, I have had a lot of lab work, um, several um, CT scans, um, and um, I've had um, my first um, chemotherapy. Um, the actual first one I was um, allergic to the chemotherapy so um, they um, had to the, and I was only on it for like maybe 10 minutes 15 minutes um, but and then they told me that I, I we just couldn't do it because I was allergic to it so um, after that, um, we had to move to me being admitted into the hospital to um, do my chemotherapy until they say otherwise. Um, so, um, the admission um, for chemotherapy, I... Um, was actually in there for eight days. Um, no, I wasn't supposed to be in there for eight days, but I was because the um, chemotherapy, well, my doctor had told me that the chemotherapy would do, um, it would um, mess up my sugar numbers. So um, they, actually fluctuate between like mm, between the teens like 115 all the way up to that's on like a really good day um, up to like 175 a um, couple of times it was over 200 but um, that was um, when I was having a meltdown because I had to shave my head. <laughs> um, well, I mean, I guess I didn't have to, but it was, um, my, my head is really swollen. Um, it's gone down actually though, as I'm touching it, I'm seeing it's gone down. Um, but after the chemotherapy, I noticed that my hair, my hair was like really sensitive, kind of like if you have the flu. Um, but it also was like, it hurt. It was, it was like really like swollen. Um, and I noticed there were like, um, like little bumps, like randomly. Um, and then as time progressed, it like became more itchy, but then it hurt whenever I would like scratch my head. So <clears throat> anyway, the other day I woke up and um, was brushing my hair and it came out in a big clump like this. So, <clears throat> um, and it was just like one swipe. <laughs> it's just like, so, um, my husband shaved my head for me, um, because otherwise it was just going to be terrible. It was going to be, you know, falling out every time I brushed it, it was probably going to be randomly falling out. Um, you know, just throughout the day or whatever. So <clears throat> we went ahead and shaved my head. Um, a little bit weird. Um, first shower with no hair was strange. 
um, and uncomfortable. Um, but, um, hey, if I had to trade being like this for the rest of my life and it'd be a long life, um, and I was in remission because there currently is not a cure, hey, I'd take bald any day. <laughs> um, so, um, that's wonderful. <laughs> that would be great. I would be very thankful. Um, I also, um, survived my first, um, life span goal, which was, um, 4th of July. The next one is Labor Day, which is actually my brother's birthday, September the 5th. Um, so we're just going to knock this right on out of the ballpark. We're going to just sail right on through his birthday. <laughs> Um, I was thinking, um, that, I mean, I haven't really worn makeup in a long time, but I think it might make me feel a little more human. Um, I've been, um, in robot mode, um, um, research mode um for, well since i found out i don't do very well with shock <laughs> basically makes me kind of um it's a delayed effect in emotions because i'm just like deer in the headlights but <clears throat> also i don't really um i try not to cry because i feel like that my feed like emotions you know positive emotions feed positivity so I try not to cry because I don't want to um, I'm just a little nervous on feeding any kind of not positive energy um, into this thing here <laughs> the goal is to kill it not to make it feel comfortable <laughs> it's like oh she said <laughs> Let's just get comfortable and multiply. <laughs> Let's get bigger. <sighs> anyway, no. So, um, I do things to try to distract myself. Um, one would be to try to distract myself from pain. Um, and two, just to try to distract myself from it in general. Um, so, like, uh-uh. Oh, little turtle. Isn't she cute? Oh, my goodness. She is so happy. Look at that. <sighs> so, um, yeah. So, I'm, I like to make things. And, um, yeah. I like, and, you know, I know that she's a little wonky, but I kind of like her that way. She's like me. So, beep, 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 beep. I would put squeaky toys in here, but, um, my dog, Barry, he is very sweet, um, but he loves squeaky toys. That's how I have them because I was going to make him toys. Um, but I don't want to put them in these. Well, I guess I could just not squish them and it would be really cute. Um, anyway, I got off track. Um, <laughs> so cute. Um, anyway, um, so I do that to distract myself. Um, and my husband is so, so, so supportive. Um, if only I had the lack of appetite that I do now. Um, that would have been so fabulous. <laughs> um, anyway, I'm, I'm a little tired. Um, which doesn't mean I'm going to take a nap. I'm just, I feel like I'm wasting t your time if I'm not really saying anything, you know, 
important or whatever. <clears throat> so anyway, oh, this um, was purchased for me um, by my dear friend, um, Samantha. Um, she, um, she's so kind and this feels really nice on my head. Um, here's something when you lay down and you've always had hair <laughs> and then your head is shaved and you lay on like your pillow or whatever, it feels, and you move your head, it feels like all your hairs are being pulled into like 12 directions. So it's very uncomfortable. Strange enough, oddly to say, it's very uncomfortable. So this is wonderful. What, you know, for one, it's soft and it feels really good on my head. And, um, um, and, um, this is actually by, um, Focus Care. It's a chemo head wrap, um, or whatever. It came with another piece, but, um, I, um, don't really wear it. Well, I have worn it at home, but look, isn't this beautiful? Um, it was very kind of her. She got me two of them, two different colors. That was very nice of her. Thank you, Sam. <laughs> anyway, so, um, so this is really, really wonderful, and I'm very grateful for this. I had no idea how much I would really appreciate this, but I do appreciate it so much. Um, well, I'm a very appreciative person by nature, though, but this is really special and very wonderful, so I really appreciate it so much. Um, it, um, people give um, things, um, gifts of their um, kindness, and um, she is very kind. Anyway, there's my husband with breakfast. <laughs> Daisy. Um, anyway, thank on, you girl. so much yeah, for watching. Daisy. Um, and I hope you have a beautiful Monday. Come on, girl. All right, bye.